Hello guys, bonjour tout le monde. This is the last video of the series Planting Leaves in Water versus Planting Leaves in Soil, which will give the best results. Voici le dernier vidéo de la série Planter des boutures dans l'eau versus Planter des boutures dans le sol. Qu'est-ce qui va donner des meilleurs résultats? Nous avons des résultats. We have results! If you haven't watched the other videos, I will link them below. You can watch the whole thing. And I will also make a video compiling everything together. It will be a longer video, but it will be from A to Z without um, you having to wait between the videos to see the progress. <laughs> Alors, si vous n'avez pas écouté les autres vidéos de la série, je les ai mis notées euh, ci-dessous dans les descriptions. Et puis, euh, je vais aussi faire une vidéo avec toutes les combinées ensemble que vous pourrez écouter tout d'un bout. Comme ça, vous n'aurez pas à attendre entre les vidéos pour euh, savoir la suite. Alors, to recap you too late, uh, we had planted some leaves in water with uh, fertilizer. Those died right away. We had planted some leaves in, in water, plain water, and those did work out. They did root and they produced little babies. And we have another casualty. I knew something bad was going to happen. <laughs> And we had planted leaves in soil deep and not deep to see the difference. Alors, quand on a commencé, on a planté des boutures dans l'eau avec euh, du, du fertilisant. Ceux-là sont mortes quasiment instantanées. On avait planté deux boutures dans l'eau, euh, trois boutures dans l'eau. On en avait perdu une, il en restait deux, ils ont raciné et fait des bébés. Et puis, euh, lors du transfert dans le sol, il y en a une autre qui a péri. Et on avait fait le test dans le sol, il y a deux boutures plantées creuses et deux boutures plantées moins creuses pour voir la différence. Une grosse expérimentation. <laughs> so, last time we transferred the water leaves that had roots and babies on them to the soil. And one of them dry, died right away. It's, the soil is dry right now, but not because I forgot to, try, to water it. It just, uh, it died almost instantly a few days after, after the transfer. Alors, cette bouture-là, elle est morte presque quelques jours après le transfert dans le sol. Alors, elle n'a pas aimé le transfert. This is something I mention a lot because every time you, 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 every time you move leaves that are root, rooting or rooted, uh, it bothers them. So, I, that's why I do not promote the water method to everybody, I, anybody actually. I know that some people have great success with it, but the, um, there are greater risks of losing. Every time we disturb the, the roots of a rooting leaf, it will it can have consequences. Alors, c'est pour ça que je, donne, je, je ne conseille jamais à personne de partir les boutures dans l'eau. Parce qu'à chaque fois qu'on dérange les racines, il peut y arriver des choses, elles peuvent réagir. Une plante mature, ça ne réagit pas tant quand on dérange ses racines, mais un petit, un petit feuille comme ça... Oui, ça peut les déranger. Parfois, non, cela a fonctionné, mais parfois, ça les dérange. Ça fait qu'il y a plus de pertes. Moi, je conseille toujours de partir dans le terreau. Mais je suis très, très consciente qu'il y a des gens qui ont des très, très bons résultats. So, these are the results. We have the little leaf that was started in water. La petite bouture qui avait été partie dans le sol. Alors, on a des belles racines. We have nice roots. But see, I planted the roots. And they didn't spread. Oh, by the way, this is day 184 of the experiment. En passant, c'est le jour 184 de cette expérimentation. Ça fait 184 jours qu'on a commencé, le 15 janvier. So this is the result for the little leaf that rooted in water. As you can see, there's one little baby there and a tiny one beside it. And that's it. Alors, on a deux petits bébés, un très petit et un moyen. Et si on regarde dans le sol, we're going to go see the method that I like to work with. And we can see there's a little bit of a difference in, uh, in the uh, conclusion is, yeah, it's quite straight. This one is the winner. <laughs> Alors, les conclusions, c'est celle-là, elle gagne. Il n'y a pas de... On ne se pose pas trop de questions. Et on va sortir tout ça. On va regarder. We're going to look. And we had... I, want, I don't want to mix them up because we had two that were planted deep and two that were planted not as deep. Uh, da, 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 which is which I... Next time I will put them in separate pots. 
sometimes I act like a dummy and I don't think before doing okay this one was not as deep I think and this one was deeper okay we got it j'ai pas pensé à mon affaire j'aurais dû les séparer au départ mais j'ai pas pensé alors so these were uh, let me be sure je suis pas certaine de qui, qui qui était planté creuse puis pas creuse celle-là est pas longue celle-là I'm gonna go see with my finger because I'm seriously I'm not sure and I don't want to show you wrong results. Okay, this one is not deep. Okay, I have two not deep. Alors, ceux-là étaient plantés pas creuse et ceux-là plus creuse. Okay, here we go. So you can see the difference. Let me take this one. Not deep. Not deep is on the left and deep is on the right. Alors, pas creuse à gauche, creuse à droite. On peut voir la différence, le, la longueur des bébés. This one was deeper, so the babies are much, the leaves are much longer because they had to travel from the bottom of the stem up to the, the soil line. And the little, the little heads, little centers of the babies are right there. And if we look, let me take them off. On va les enlever là, ça va être plus facile. On va voir plus. If I take it off, we can compare them side by side. It will be more easier to uh, compare. Let me take, uh, let's take this one. And this is the results. That's what the difference when you plant deep and not deep. C'est la différence quand on plante creuse et pas creuse. So the one that was near the soil line, all it had to do is pierce the soil and start growing a, a, a plant. And there's more than one. There's two plants in there. <laughs> okay, let me take it off. Oh, there's three in there. My goodness, this thing really wants to make babies. Okay, let me do that. So this one and there you can see the difference. I don't know if you can see the difference, but... I do. Je sais pas si vous pouvez voir la différence, mais moi je le vois là. <laughs> la, the plant that was on the leaf that was less deep is more developed than the one that was deeper. La plante qui était plus, moins, moins profonde, elle est plus développée que la plante qui était plus profonde. They will, in essence, they will, when they grow up, we won't be able to see the difference. But there is a difference as they're coming up uh, from the leaves. Quand elles sont petites comme ça, là, on, voit une, on voit une différence, mais quand elles vont être plantées dans le sol, moi je les plantais tantôt, elles vont pousser, mais dans une semaine, on ne verra plus de différence. Je ne pourrais pas te dire c'est quelle qui, euh, quelle qui a été poussée sur euh, creuse et pas creuse et différence. So, these are the results. You can see in the soil what that gave, and that's a lot of babies in there. That's, yeah. And the results of the water experiment, two, two babies, that's it. 184 days for two babies and versus, I don't know how many I have in here, maybe I'd say close to 20. Of course, there's four leaves, but per leaf, there's about, like this one, right, really fast, I'd say it has at least 10 babies on it. So, celle-là, je dirais qu'elle a au moins 10 babies dessus versus celle qui était dans l'eau. Our baby. So there you go. You can reach your own conclusions. Which method do you want to do? <laughs> Water or soil? So you choose. So that's it, folks. The last one for this one. Uh, I may redo this experiment again in the future because I know that uh, I could have planted actually this leaf as soon as that got roots. So I may do it again in the future and, and do different, maybe plant more leaves and do different techniques on each to see if I could have done something better with the water method. Um, for now, for my, my conclusions for now is soil is better. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this series. It was a long one. Don't forget to like the video. Um, when people like the videos, it lets me know that you like this type of content and I will make more. And um, yeah, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day and we'll see you soon. Bye! J'espère que vous avez apprécié cette petite série. N'oubliez pas d'aimer la vidéo pour euh, me laisser savoir que vous aimez ce genre de contenu. Et puis, euh, 
bien, je vais vous souhaiter une superbe journée et je vous dis à la prochaine. Bye!